<laughs> the garbage truck has passed, and yeah. we're back at Angels and Kings, yeah. uh, you can see, with the iHeart Movies event, which would be uh, Keep Abreast, keep-a-breast.org. And I, Erica here with me again, so I might be repeating myself, but, you know, a little editing never hurt anybody. You know, so. What does he want to know from me? Um, secret? Uh, see, that's the worst. Mm -hmm. The worst, the idea. Is when it's the interviewer <laughs> who's supposed to go after the interviewee. I know what happens. They do. This is why I, I played in the band for many years, and I realized how do you make the person uncomfortable? That's talking with you. Because when you do an interview, generally speaking, that person may be in college or high school, and they're going to see a band that they like. They interview them, then you ask them a question back, and then they freeze. Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't like the plug thing, and I'm pointing to my hair. <laughs> How's it going? How you doing? You doing all right? This house. Does he have to come? Are you from Boston? No, I'm from Miami. Where were you born? Yeah, Miami. Oh, really? yeah. So I think there's a lot of douchebags going on in there. You know. What do you mean uh, I've come across a lot of this, a lot of that. It's like, are you fucking kidding me? What, me what makes a douchebag? A, a douchebag is someone who holds up their hand. Up. So it's cool. I don't want any of that. That's stupid. Dude, what happened? Something happened. There's a little no, more. Nothing happened. Just... Well, this onion's got a few, few layers to peel. That's all yeah. I'm saying. You know. I just got done with a night of poker. Uh, you lost some, together. tell me you lost some money, because that yeah, yeah. will become a little I made some quick. mistakes, I made some mistakes, that's true. That's true. true. Atlantic City? But I had a great time, I had a great time, regardless. Yeah. But what I'm more upset about is the poker going on in here, when there's no fucking chips. I don't know if anybody knows, but I'm sure Brooks is real good at this. He, uh, he'll take photos from random places and throw them in the Ice Surrender uh, newsletters. Uh, he'll probably find a photo of me. Uh, from Facebook, which I didn't post, but there's this whole thing where you can. Uh, what is it called when you when you somebody posts a photo of you? They tag, tag you. You tag. You're in. Yeah. <laughs> so then they find you of your Halloween costume. Well, there's this, this viral video that had like eight million views. Of this little kid Jonathan was at a fair, and he got all nervous. He was doing an interview as if I hey, will we'll act it. You know, I am here at Angels and Kings. Um. Wow, your costume. Uh, at the fair is really great. Um, what are you? I like turtles. <laughs> Alright, Jonathan. <laughs> Thanks for being here at the fair. So that's how. Oh, that was my Halloween costume. Uh, I was the I like turtles kid. And Rob had to explain it just like that every time somebody asked who he was. Because <laughs> nobody knows the I like turtles kid except for the 7.5 million people that saw him on YouTube. <laughs> what are you calling right now? You know what? Yeah. Sometimes, what do you call it? Right sometimes now? you just gotta put it all on the table. It's true. See what happens. Yeah, sure. You, know, you just gotta go big sometimes. It's all big. You go know? big or go home. Go big or go home. <laughs> it's true. It's yeah. true. And you know what? If you're not willing to not necessarily go big, but to compete, mm -hmm. put your chips in, introductions, conversation. If you're not willing to put in for that, then it's game over. It's game over. Really quick, really, really quick interlude. I remember a night when I was hanging out with this man and we both had the same blue hoodie on. Was it TBK? Uh, and KOTV. But what happened was, is now Brooks flashes the photo of us wearing the blue hoodie that night. Oh my god. Insert there.